this is not something I want to do. I've been putting this off for probably like eight years. Yeah, it's probably been eight years, but the like clothing charity that's in this area is picking up between like I think we put it out Tuesday night and they come Wednesday morning or something like that and today's Monday so um I have the night I guess tomorrow um although I I'm really bad at doing stuff during the day um but I have to get all of my stuff together and I just decided that I'm just gonna sit down and just do it and it's going to take longer than just tonight, but I also know that I get a tiny bit of energy from taking my pain medication, um, but I'm not due for it for a little bit. So I'm just going to try to get through this as much as I can, and I'll be able to take my pain medication soon. I need to hook up to my fluids, but I think I just need to suck it up and just do it and just get it done between tonight and tomorrow. So. Here we go guys, wish me luck. <laughs> okay, so um, I started at least. Started doesn't mean stop. <laughs> just didn't do very much. So this is just everything that came out of my closet, which is not that much. Um, the real issue is going to be these two dressers. Um, and I think what I was just thinking about, I think what I'm gonna do is do this, get, you know, just do the, the hall now, like the major hall, and then like move it out of my room and then put a new like empty basket in and try to do a haul again. So I'll do it in two parts. Um, yeah. I'm thinking maybe I should try and model some of the types of clothes that I don't wear anymore that I have. That's a lot of energy, so I don't know if I'm gonna wanna actually do that. But I think it would be fun for you guys, so maybe I will. See, like this is the keeper. Love it. So. Now I am keeping this because this is cute for the summer. It's really like flowy. So this one I'm actually keeping. So this would be from 2008. A solid decade old. Too tight. I don't know why I ever needed this. I don't know why I needed this. Go in in the back. And this one will be from like 2010, 2011. Go in way out of just now. Have no idea why I bought this. Never took the tag off Forever 21. I don't know. <laughs> hey you guys, so it is actually 11.30 at night on, um, when is today? Tuesday. And, um, I have not vlogged yet today. I woke up not feeling well, and I kind of was forced out of bed because my nurse had to do my, my, um, dressing change. And then um, after that, uh, my mom had been out. I probably did something, I don't know what. Um, I went with my mom to the store. Um, it's weird, we had like a family friend, like a neighbor that uh, told us about it where it's, um, I think it's like an outlet store. I'm not 100% sure what it is, but literally it's, um, they said that they used to do pop-ups and um, trying to maybe see if I can put you guys down somewhere they they had done pop-ups but now they're like actually like in a legitimate like location um it's like a little small place but um I gotta show you guys what I got I just got like everything except these two tables were $15 like everything they had like dresses like for formal events like it was I don't buy that stuff because I really don't have a need to wear it like at all ever um but i just thought that that was insane like that it was that um all that stuff was that cheap i don't know where i put my coconut water okay i'm thirsty okay so really quickly what i got because you know all of us spoonies are into the outfits that you can just spend your entire day in 
literally the cutest, easiest gray. Um, it's thin, but it's just like a gray hoodie, and that's it. Like, it's, it's thin, but it's really nice, honestly. And this is going to be great um, to just lounge in. And the thing, because it's so plain, I can put it with, like, some of my crazy, like, leggings. Like, I have leggings that are um, really patterny um, from when I was working at Bath & Body Works, like, permanently. And, because um, they... Bath & Body Works and Victoria's Secret are owned by the same company, limited brands, so my uh, discount that I got at Bath & Body Works, I also got at Pink and Victoria's Secret. So, like, I have these, and this is VSX, which is the, um, the uh, Victoria's Secret sport line. So, like, this paired with something plain is perfect, because if you try to pair anything not plain with this, you're gonna you're not going to find anything. Um, and then my mom kind of just said to get this, and she said even if it's just hanging around the house, just like a little t-shirt, not a, a, a v-neck or anything, just a t-shirt, really breathable and like thin and nice. And then what I'm excited about, even though this is just a lounge around in two, is this. Maybe I should try it on for you guys. I'm gonna try it on. Okay, so I'm not sure how well you guys are gonna see this, but it's just like, it's a little rough, but I figure that like, once I've like, worn it in a little bit more, it would be good. Um, and then what's really cool is that if I'm wearing like regular black, sorry, I'm having problems with my pick. Um, if I'm having, if I'm wearing like regular black leggings or like shorts or something, then it is a crop. So it's really cool, like, it's, it's cool because it's like kind of sexy, but also spoony friendly, basically. And that would be like the perfect style. If I had to change my style to every, to anything else, it would be that style. So, I love that this is a crop. Love it, love it, love it. Anyway, so everything other than that, um, today was not a good day. Um, I'm just struggling so... Sorry, again, pick line problems. Um, I'm just struggling a lot recently with depression and all that stuff. Um, but I've really been trying to, like, allow myself to have really bad breakdowns, but then, like, I had a really bad one today, and then I fell asleep for like an hour and then I woke up and was feeling a lot better. So like I'm basically just trying to do um trying to do that um you know have these mental breakdowns and I'll be okay with it but I'm gonna go through um we did put um the clothes that I had put in into the basket last night um out in a bag um, so this company is going to come and, or organization is going to come and pick it up in the morning. And then my mom basically said, obviously, get rid of more stuff if you can. And, uh, you know, in the future, we'll get rid, we'll donate it. So that's what I'm going to try to do tonight. I took pain medication, like, 45 minutes ago. I don't know if I said that already. And, um, I'm just going to try to go through stuff a little bit more. I kind of did, like, a quick sweep last night, so I'm going to try to do stuff a little bit more organize my stuff in general because let's be real I'm almost 24 I'm gonna need it to move out soon I need to get my, my, my shit together basically so that is what is going on I'll keep you all updated but I'm really proud of myself I'm really proud of myself for getting my um going through my clothes yesterday and I actually was talking to my mom and mom my mom was like you know in the basket you had a dress that you wore to your sister's uh, sixth grade graduation, I was like, no, there's no way. I remembered what dress it was. I did. I totally wore it to my sister's sixth grade graduation. She's a sophomore in college. Um, so that's 7th, 8th, 9th, 11th, 12th, so 8 years old. 8 years old and I still have it. So I am going to, I'm going to keep going through my stuff. So 
Thank you for your patience recently with my videos. I'm working on getting vlogs uploaded to tonight, so. Okay, so I haven't really started, I've started the vlog related stuff, but I haven't started cleaning out my room, but I think it's 12.41, so I'm gonna take my sleeping medication, I think, now. But I realized that because I was in and out of sleeping for most of the day, that I didn't do any of my like special things. So what I'm gonna do is do, um, I got, uh, plain whole yogurt with like five different probiotics in it and I'm gonna actually put matcha in it and I'm gonna mix maple syrup which doesn't sound appetizing but I think when matcha is mixed with things that it doesn't taste as bad as it does when it's by itself so I'll let you guys know all right well here we go this yogurt I've never tried before and it's kind of um, it's thick. I mean, it's not thick. It's the opposite of thick. It's, uh, like, watery, sort of? I don't know. Terrible color. I can't really even taste the matcha, to be honest. A little bit, but... The maple syrup probably takes the, um, takes the, uh, the taste away. Alright guys, it's just about 3 o'clock in the morning. Um, I'm gonna sign off for tonight, and, um, hopefully tomorrow goes a little bit smoother. <laughs> um, and I, I did start clearing out more stuff, but I'll just finish it tomorrow. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm uploading a vlog now. Thank you guys for watching, and yeah, I'll see you tomorrow morning.